I'm author Amy Shannon, and this is Behind the Cover. Today I'm going to be talking about Passionate Retribution 2. It's the second book in my Passionate Retribution series, um, and it's also to kind of announce that my book Passionate Retribution 4 will be coming out in May of 2020. Um, Passionate Retribution 2 has the same characters um, as the first book, Patch Passionate Retribution. Um, it's the main character is Carly and it still talks about uh, her relationship with um, her best friends Peter and Derek. Um, they're the gay couple that lives next door to her. Um, it um, also focuses on not only her relationship with her former partner Elliot Marshall um, but also her relationship with her father Jack Edwards. Um, there also, uh, she has a, a new relationship with her brother, um, Terry Edwards, um, and, you know, more of her friends and family kind of come into the mix, um, and it starts out that Carly is, um, and her friends and family are mourning the loss of someone very close to them. Um, so she not only um, is dealing with the loss. Um, she is also trying to find who did that. Um, it's uh, you know you, you see Carly in a in a different light, a different mindset than before. Um, you know she always wanted to get back at the person who attacked her, and she was able to do that. Um, but this is different. Someone was um, taken from her, um, and she uh, knows that this person was murdered, but she blames herself um, because she passed off a case, and she is not sure um, how or why this person died. Um, she also encounters um, some new characters um, and she builds relationships and she also um, finds out that not everybody is what they seem or not everyone can be trusted. Um, Carly um, is also, her name is Caroline. Um, Peter and Derek, they call her Kiki. Um, Carly's a really strong character and she's one that kind of evolves. She learns from what she's done in the past. She learns from experience and she's really um, smart and um, though she loves being a PI, there's a part of her that just, it misses that being an NYPD detective that she was. Um, there's a whole story behind how and, um, why she couldn't return to her job. Um, and it kind of is revealed in the first story, but you also see more of those, that particular action, um, is kind of like a story um, that's always told about her. Um, so it kind of, you know, um, follows her wherever she goes. And even though she regrets what she did, um, it's still there. And some people applaud her for doing that. And some people stay away from her because of what she did. Um, I'm not going to give it away. I don't want to give away any spoils, spoilers in these videos. Um, Passionate Retribution, the first book, um, is 99 cents on Kindle and if you've um, I don't you could read each story by itself it's a standalone story I do recommend that to get to really know the characters and their past and their history if you kind of start from the beginning and work your way through um, I really like these characters Passionate Retribution is the third book that I've ever written and I didn't know if I was going to write anything after that. Um, I wrote other stories. I wrote a long saga. Um, this is a story that um, I thought that there needed to be more for Carly and her family and friends and, you know, kind of what was going on next. You know, what happens to her and her friends, how the last book, um, when it ended, um, and it ended without a cliffhanger. But when it ended, you know, what what kind of came next? Um, that's part of how I like telling the story. I like to know, you know, everything's filled with action and drama comes to a climax. I like to know what happens the next day. 
um, you know, if I'm watching a movie or something, it's, um, you know, sometimes they end the movie after like the final building blows up or something like that, or one partner is holding another one because he's got a gunshot wound and that's how it ends. I like to know what, what kind of consequences happen the next day. So I like movies and stories that tell me what happened. You know, sometimes they say that the next day or a year later and they show whatever is going on. And I kind of like to know what happened. So I write that way that even when the dust settles and the climax and everybody's taking a deep breath, like, oh my God, I can't believe that happened. They um, show what's going on next in their life. So um, if you're interested and I um, kind of like, it's, I don't want to say mystery, but it's a detective story. Um, but there's a different levels, um, layer, layers of the plots and um, it kind of all mixes into one. There's a little bit of romance. It's not like the main focus, but it's there. Carly's relationships um, with different people and what comes out of those relationships as well and how they affect her, how they affect people around her. So if you're interested in Passionate Retribution 2, um, it is available on Amazon as are the um, Passionate Retribution and the third book. Um, and there'll be another video coming up soon about Passionate Retribution 3. So um, this has been Behind the Cover. I hope you enjoy it and I'll see you next time.